effect or effect? Which one do you use and in what instance? How can we determine? We can use the word Malvern, M-A-L-B-E-R-N. I use letters from Malvern to make an acronym. So it's A-B-E-N, taken from Malvern. Effect is most often a verb, and a verb is an action word. Effect is most often a noun, and a noun is a person, what place, what thing, or idea. So, if you are struggling with which one to use, find out in the sentence, is it serving as a, a verb, or is it serving as a noun? For instance, you affect something to get an effect. You affect something to get an effect. Watch, I'm going to show you an effect. Effect is the ending product. For instance, look. Wow. This is like French So, basically, that's just bacon, soda, and vinegar. But the end result is a what? Effect. Effect is when a change is brought about, right? Okay, so most, there's always one little person or one little thing that makes an exception to the rule. Anytime you want to talk about a huge change being brought about due to exercise or a policy or some sort of physical activity, you're going to use effect, okay? I think the best way for us to figure out if ones we're using them correctly is just to go over them on a worksheet. So if we look at the worksheet, Number one, on number one, the blank of the preacher's words on the young boy's body was astounding. Is it effect or effect? Which one? Effect. Which one? Effect. Effect. So wh why do we know if why do we know if it's effect? Because what? It's the end result of the word. It's the end. It's but it's also serving as a noun. And watch this: the word the ends in an e. Anytime you, the word D is right before, it's always going to be effect. Does that make sense? Yes. So number two, Sheila was surprised that her book could affect or affect people so profoundly. Affect. Affect, because it's a verb, right? Number three, meditation had an obvious effect on Mandy's general behavior. Effect or affect? Effect, because it had the word and right before it, correct? Yeah. Number four, Patty realized her criticism had no effect on Roger's work or effect. Okay. What? Okay. Effect, because it is a noun. Number five, the coach's encouraging words before the big game were effective or effective? Okay. Which one? Uh, effective would make it be a verb. Oh. Effective. Number six. Patty Charles' words didn't affect or affect Rogers much. Effect. Effect, because that's a verb, right? Something you can do. Number seven. The president couldn't, what, which one? A new policy. When it's a policy or a change, what did I say it was? Effect. Anytime something happens because of something, it's effect. The president couldn't effect a new policy, effect. Number eight, his old teacher's wise words had the most effect or effect on Tom's career. Which one? Which one is E or A? Because right, look right before that. Before the word most is the word the. Most is an adjective. Describing the noun effective, but the word the is there, so we know it's a noun. Those are called article adjectives. A, N, or the are article adjectives. So anytime you see those article adjectives, you know a noun is going to come after, and that noun is going to be effect. Number nine, Anna's photograph had a profound what? Okay. Effect or affect on John? Okay. Had a profound what? Okay. Effect. It's a noun. In order for it to be an effect, it has to do what? Perform action, correct? And number 10, Chris was curious how the crime rate affected, 
affected, affected harm rates in his neighborhood. Okay, I think we have an understanding. 